I have been joined by Congress Party's MP from Tamil Nadu, Jyoti Mani ji. Ma'am, what do you have to say about the situation which is panning out in Sri Lanka? So what's happening in Sri Lanka is a deeply painful. This is not a one-day trouble. They are majoritarian politics. They are oh, their political views against ethnic Tamils and the Muslim minorities and the tension created within the Sri Lanka. Mishandling of the situation is bring Sri Lanka to this point. People are starving. Price rise is high, skyrocketing. There is no employment. People are fighting against the same regime. Those who are supported by 80% of the majority people. So there is a lesson for India. If we are not talking about development, we are practicing a majoritarian politics like what BJP is doing. India also will face the same fate. Hope before that, Indian people will awake and fight this fascist Modi regime. What's your major demand as far as the government is uh, concerned, from, uh, as far as Sri Lanka is concerned from the government? See, now government of India has to intervene quickly because there is so far a diplomatic failure from the Indian government. Like port like uh, Hammandotam has been taken away by China. As long as Congress government was in power, actually the diplomacy with the uh, Sri Lankan government was very good. We ensure that actually Sri Lanka is um, uh, take the side of uh, India. Also, we Congress government protected Tamils like anything. Rajiv Gandhi ji has lost his life because of, uh, he went ahead to protect the uh, Tamil people over there. Now, at least now Indian government has to wake up. They have to... Uh, use all its diplomatic skills and bring Sri Lanka out of China because that is very very important for us strategically. Well that is what Jyoti Mani, Congress's Member of Parliament from Tamil Nadu has to say. This is Supriya Bharadwaj for India today in Delhi.